Hey guys, what's up? It's Wolf here one only, and welcome to Pokemon MMO 3D. Yeah, I found this game recently. Well, actually, I found it like a few days ago, but it's been it's been inside of maintenance for like a whole entire week. So yeah, it just came out of maintenance. It looked pretty strange and everything. Seems like y'all are holding up to 200 people right now. There's only 68 people playing, thankfully. So that means I can get in and show you guys some gameplay. So be right back. Alright, so we can create a character. Okay, so there's only two characters to choose from. No, we always choose male for a while now. Let's choose female. Why not? Name already taken? Okay. There we go. That name's not taken. Push M to bring a mini map to talk to NPCs. Walk up to them and click them. Wow, the late the lag on these guys is amazing. <laughs> so get my first Pokemon, dude. Actually, oh god, the sensitivity is pretty bad. Is there a way I can change that? Please tell me there's a way I can change my sensitivity. Hold on. Uh, no. There actually isn't a way you can change the sensitivity. Oh, isn't that fantastic? No, oh, no. There it is. <laughs> I was about to say, hold on a second, dude. Ah, uh, way better. Okay, yeah. Oh my god, is it inverted? It is inverted. Why? Why would you do such a thing? Okay, that's somewhat a lot better. But yeah. Here's the game. Actually, does look that bad. I wonder, can I zoom into my face? No, I can't. All right, let's go. Pokemon Adventure. Wonder what starters they have. Somebody has a Pidgey. Okay, that Pidgey just vanished into thin air. We're not gonna talk about that. Professor Oak's lab. Oh, you're the breeder. What do you guys have here? Size variations. Oh, is this like your guy's form or something? That people can mess with? <laughs> oh yeah, you can just mess with the actual form itself. That's pretty neat. I like that. <laughs> so I can even scroll down on it too. That's actually really interesting. Okay, let's go up here. Hello? You, you Professor Oak, catch these hands. No, never mind. Fuji son. Okay. So I'm guessing all these are the starters? Jeez. Nah, we just probably went the wrong way. Yo, Professor, where you at? Where you? Okay, he's probably up here. Oh, red and blue are talking to each other. You guys are very normal size compared to me. Yeah, that's red's dialogue, all right. <laughs> oh, fuck you too, blue. Every time. See, this is why we just can't have nice things, especially when blue's around. Hello? Oh, you just assistant? Choose my Pokemon. I always went Squirtle, to be honest. So this time, I guess I'll join the fan base and go Charmander. Okay, so M, I can bring out the mini map, and it shows me all the players that are nearby. I'm the blue one, okay. Noted. So what is all this? The coin shop. Oh, to where you can change your character look and design. That's actually pretty neat, but it would be really neat if you can earn all this currency just by playing a game. Which is probably what it is, to be honest. Since we already have 400, I'm pretty sure that's what it is. I mean, it, is, it has to be a non-profit, just because... Otherwise, Nintendo would come after it. 
Oh, somebody has a sweet coon? Okay. Just a casual sweet coon going around. I wonder if there is a way you can just bring out your Pokemon like that. Oh, there it is. Oh yeah, we could transform into it. That's what it was. Oh! I was kind of confused at first. Wait, what's going on down here? You can push it again, just to bring him back. So that's what was different about this game. You can actually play as a Pokemon. <laughs> move around and use the moves. Don't you wish Game Freak would do something like this? Probably not. Hi. I'm here to scratch your face. What? I can't scratch his face? His face? Right there? Wow. Oh, that's probably somebody else. That's probably what it is. Minimap. All I was about to say is, is the shadow humping the ground? <laughs> Alright boys, we're going on an adventure. I don't know where we're going, but we're going somewhere. It's probably like gyms and stuff too. We just gotta find them all. Can we swim? Time to find out. No, we drown. This is how you catch water types at its prime, guys. Who needs surf <laughs> when you drown? Okay. Can we go inside the houses? That'd be actually pretty good. Oh my god. It looks like it probably could be a future thing. Well, this house can be went inside of. Okay, so some of them don't have, like, actual things in it yet. Okay. Pretty neat. And all the computers are usable. So what happened if I just put in my YouTube channel, right? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I am not got to be that guy, okay? But if you're going to give people the advantage, they'll use it. it. Even tells you the population of the server up here, too. Which is actually pretty interesting. So you can see how many people are in your server. There's now 69. Uh, I wonder if they're going to make more servers if this gets like really popular. I really hope they don't do anything to this game. Because it actually looks pretty freaking neat, dude. Okay, I'm about to say, I've been searching for this door. Is there anything in here? No? No, no, I think about it. The 3D Pokemon is kind of confusing. Because normally you would get the over... Get the whole layout of the house from a top-down point of view. Now you gotta use more time to search for stuff. <laughs> I guess that's what Game Freak talked but Yeah, I don't know. I like exploring. Especially if they can do it right. I mean, it's impossible to mess it up if you just create barricades and stuff. Like actual Pokemon does. <laughs> ah, I can't hit you now. Yeah, boy. Take that, son. I can just run away until you're until you get all that stuff. Get smack break for XP. Okay, so we have energy too. Noted. Okay, that's kinda weird of a way to battle, that's for sure. So is it it's kinda just gonna be like a DPS MMO type of situation. Which like I said I like. But energy is going to be interesting. 
because that's basically like your um, power points. Hello? Anybody in this house? So I guess they don't have other NPCs except for just the uh, actual Poke Center. Or Professor's Lab, actually. So I can understand why this game was in maintenance for like a whole week. It definitely looks like it's going to take a lot of manage and stuff like that. They probably got to have like a small team working on it at the moment. I was first was checking this house. Anything in here? Oh. It's a Pokeball. <gasps> An Eevee! What? Dude, where the hell did the Eevee even come from? I appreciate that guy. He literally just showed me an Eevee. I can, oh, you can watch an ad for bucks. Dude, say no more. Be right back. What is the ad? Huh? Nani? Have I been jabated? I feel like I've been jabated. Hold on. This ad is not an ad I thought. <laughs> okay, did I get my stuff at least? You didn't jabate me, did you? You definitely jabated me. Um, how dare you? I didn't even get my coins. I feel lied to. I definitely feel lied to. I don't know how I feel about this game anymore. <laughs> Dude, just exploring these buildings is just so much fun. Okay. I think the mini map is going to tell us where else we need to go. Uh... Actually, what town are we in? Do we not have like a full-size map of the whole region? I don't think they would have made it that far right now. I don't think it's that far in development. But it is fun to check out. Uh, probably the first town, actually. Can I steal your mail, actually? Give me that. No? Okay. <laughs> Just put a Pokeball in a... Uh, Mel and this Gyarados or something. Can I sit on stuff? No. I wonder if they have any commands. Since I'm here by myself. Okay, no, they don't have any commands. Ah, uh, I'm I'm sad now. Well, well, at least we tried. <laughs> There's no sit commands, no dance commands. Nothing like that. So we came up from there. We need to head over here. You know, now that I think about it, how are they going to approach fly? Are they going to actually let you fly on that Pokemon you choose? Or are they going to... Or are they going to think of something different or just go with the same thing that Game Freak does? Just have a Pokemon fly you there. Or just have that black portrait fly you there, actually. <laughs> so many choices and things they can actually do. Hold on. Yo, Rata. What? I'm about to say, I have a target. Ah, too bad your attack is down too, buddy. Yeah, I'm too fast for you. Oh, I rammed him somehow. Oh, tackle dashes. It does. It's not like one. To, oh, that's interesting. There, he actually took the actual Pokemon approach. I like that. So I guess think Volt Tackle would be the same thing at that point. Okay, I like this game <laughs> already. I like the creators of this game already.
Huh. Get tackled, buddy. Ah, but well, fucking Eevee, dude. <laughs> this game is amazing in every last way. I cannot wait for more. Please. For the love of God, start a Patreon or something. Because I don't know if you guys even have a Patreon. That would be fan freaking tastic. I would definitely support that. But then again, wouldn't that be profiting? No? Eh, because it, it would more be like... Devation, wouldn't it? Uh, eh. It's weird when it comes to like, copyrighted stuff. That's for sure. I'm pretty sure a lot of passionate people would actually join on just to help. And not all the time just for the money. Hey, you! Come over here and fight this Eevee. Yeah! Oh, I can hit you from a distance with that. That's cool. Yeah! What, you thought it was nice and sweet, dude? What, you thought it was nice and sweet? Can we throw a Pokeball? Oh, yeah, we don't have any Pokeballs. So I wonder if they're like this, would you be able to throw a Pokeball? Or would you just catch it? The one thing I'm kind of hoping that they'll do is the whole Pokemon on the shoulder thing or... No, actually, they can't really code that with this model. That's going to be like kind of weird, I'm guessing. I think the whole Pokemon following you thing in your first slot is actually pretty interesting. But... I guess they're thinking about just completing the game right now. Which I understand. Did I not tag one? No, I guess I'm not tagging one. Are we missing each other because he's a flying type? Oh! I jumped and hit him. Wait, are you saying this game has aerial battle logic? <laughs> Is that what I'm hearing here? That's what that's what it seems like. Interesting. Okay, hold up. So we might need to Oh, it actually tells me where Pokemon are, actually, I think. Yeah, it tells me where Pokemons are. This minimap actually isn't half bad. So I'm guessing it's just this area right now. I kind of want to keep going, but that doesn't look like it's very promising. <laughs> oh my god, I can just straight up jump. It's like I'm on one of those bikes. Ah, the music changes to whatever town you're in. I love it. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. Bye, Rata. Just don't attack me like bee drills. Okay, so you can walk too. You don't always have to run. That's just by ta tapping shift. I think it's toggle, actually. Yeah, it's toggle. There's other players running over there. Alright, let's go back to Professor Oak's lab and see if we can find any Pokeballs or anything. Just to like use, and plus we need to heal our um, Charmander. Oh, actually, if you just push home up here, it takes you back. Yo, Professor, where you at? Hey, can I have the other one? I mean, you just have two sitting there, so I might as well take those. Ah, there they are. Okay, nice. So I guess I missed that when I uh, left. I wonder how evolving works in this game, actually. They even put the sound in. Can I have these balls? Dude? Those look a lot better. Alright, hold up. Let's go. Let's go catch something. So, 
let's go test our theory. If they're faded, can we catch them? Hopefully there's like a fishing rod or something. Can you catch somebody else's Pokemon? <laughs> or do they actually just have to be weak? That I hope they don't just have to be weak or anything like that. But then again, all the rest of the Pokemon in the games do it. But uh, I don't know. Isn't it when um, they're faded? You can still catch them in the Pokemon series, because that's what I remember. Dude, I tried to watch an ad. You guys didn't give me an ad. You gave me something weird. Yeah, you gave me this. That's not an ad. Wait, did I miss? Okay. Uh, I think it is that you have to um, have it just weak and use the Pokeball. Unless I'm missing like some button. Capture. See. Oh no. It actually uh, works this way. Oh, that's weird. Can you pick that up? Actually, I'm curious now. Can you actually pick it up? Or did you just waste it? Okay, no, you can actually have it back. Wow. Oh, it actually does work that way. There, You can catch them while they're faded. I like that. Thank you. The one logic I wish Game Freak would have stuck with. <laughs> I mean, if you're going to put it in an anime, it might as well be in the game, too. But then again, it, it's kind of meh. <laughs> I'm just joking, Game Freak. Don't hurt me, okay? It's, it's just all jokes, alright? <laughs> Nothing serious. They're going to find me in my sleep. I already know it. Alright, where's, where's a Pidgey? We need a Pidgey. Just to complete the set. There's another one out here flying. That's a rata. Rata. -ta -ta -ta. That's another one. Where'd the Pidgeys go? Did I murder them all? I only killed one. Pretty sure. Happy they have controls to where we can understand, though. Seems like Eevee's the best one to start with. Especially if we can find like a stone or something. Coming this way. <laughs> Sucker. What, you thought it was nice and cool? You thought I couldn't hit you? Well, you're sadly mistaken. Now get in the Pokeball! Alright. We've abducted another one. I, I'm not gonna lie. I definitely wish there was like a main map that you can pick up here. Because that would actually be pretty perfect. Because just having this going on can... Um, I have a lot of questions about. Just because I will never actually know if there's like more destinations to be honest. Is there any maps here? Oh, this is the... This is the road map. That's what it does.
Add NPC Ryu. Okay, dude. <laughs> Well, now nah, it's the news of what's been added, actually. Okay, so where do I find these, boy? Let's go find those. We're on an adventure at this point. Jeez, there is a lot to explore in this game. There's a whole bunch of water over there, so I wonder if there's a Gyarados. That red, shiny Gyarados that everybody's always talking about, you know? <laughs> huh? Did somebody just level up? Okay. <laughs> I'm thinking of the wrong game, too. Funny enough. Oh! We can actually just drown underwater, guys. It's easy and simple. Uh, well, I'm guessing if we go by Charmander logic, he would die under this water. <laughs> Since Pokemon is pretty damn dark when it comes to that. Eevee! Attack! Did you just fucking bubble me, dude? Murder! <laughs> okay, no, no, that that's not how you throw a Pokeball! Pick up the Pokeball! That, that has to be... They need to make a way to cancel this. They need to make a way to cancel it. <laughs> like, if it doesn't hit anything without then like a certain time limit, or just make a cancel button. Okay, thankfully, it, it hit it on the way down. <laughs> ha! Probably world is now on ours. Now, where's that Gyarados or Magic Carp? I know you're around here somewhere. I'll drown for it. Actually, only Polly are out here. Well, good thing we don't need a fishing rod or anything. That's pure perfection right there. I wonder will they have um, tag battles like most other games. It's funny because I can just go out here and explore as much as I want to be honest. Just because we have the teleport home button up here. That'll take us back to the lab. So we'll see if anything new is out here. Apparently there's something right here. Oh, just a Pidgey. Oh, what was that? Oh, there's actually something out here. We're on a route? Wait, what? This is an actual route? PvP area. Oh, they have PvP area. Dude, that's actually pretty neat. It needs to be marked on the map, though. <laughs> the routes have to be marked on the map as well. When we're going through here. Because I didn't even know this was a freaking route. I thought this was just some kind of random area. They need a map guy. I didn't even know this was a path. Hello? That doesn't even look like a path on the map. <laughs> well, at least we found a route one. Let's go visit this city up here then. That city looks tempting. Let's skip to it. All right, boys, we're here. I skipped all the way to it. We're still skipping. All right, nice. So we, oh, 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 okay. Pretty interesting. Are you able to go inside of it though? Oh my God. I was about to say, I don't think it's finished because that angle, that was weird. So that's something over there. There's a few players over here, not a whole bunch. I guess the windows are making it look like it's the walls are, aren't there for some reason? Weird. Why did this house face that way? Anyhow. Is this a PvP area? I think it is. The hell is that thing? Oh, this, this is the Pokemon Center. Is there a trading center in here too? Because normally Pokemon Centers have the trading center. Or do you just straight up trade now? Huh.
I'm actually pretty amazed, to be honest. Because this game has came this far. And impressed. <gasps> I could buy stones. Where is the what? The okay, I was about to say, where's the water stone? Dear God, you're asking for a high price there. <laughs> you know what? For the first time ever, I won't buy it for a high price. Buying it at a high price is pretty. Nani? Why are you guys murdering poor Pokemon over here? I do want to see what this is before we actually end off. Oh, this is a gym! Jam, jam, da, 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 da. So I guess if you're the gym leader, you'll be here. But there isn't a gym leader. Oh, I guess it's like people who can actually sign up to be a gym leader. That's pretty cool. Is what I think, at least. <laughs> oh, okay. I would like to see where this game heads in the future. But right now, it seems like it's in the, like, really, really, really early stages. Obviously. Because you got a lot more models you got to deal with. And a lot more, like, furniture and stuff like that. It's a way heavier project than just whatever the hell a Game Freak's doing. Like I said, it's a joke. Don't hurt me. I'm kidding. That person's flying up there. Hold on a second. I have a Pidgey. Oh god, I can't fly. No. Oh, of course you can. I can't? I see how it is, game. Are you saying Pidgeys can't fly out here? Alright, fair enough. I understand. Screw Pidgeys, huh? Flies F. Okay, never mind. I can't fly. I'm out of here, boys! You, you thought you could catch me. Oh, fly actually costs stamina. Okay. This is actually pretty neat. <laughs> if you guys want another video of me exploring this game, then hit me with, I guess, five likes? I don't, I don't care. Do five likes and I'll just make another one. Why not? Hi. Let me sit on, sit on your head. There we go. <laughs> anyway, hope you guys enjoyed. I will see you guys on the next one. I'm kind of curious what's going to happen if I run out of energy up here. Okay, I'm transcending to deeper forms of... Oh, dear God. That's beautiful. Oh. Did I die? Oh, no, I just went back to the ground. Okay, good. <laughs> Peace out.